Is that Jesus Christ? Please. Miracle or a fantasy? It's a well-established fact that we can't ever see God. But as these videos will show you today, sometimes divine figures such as Jesus Christ make an exception to restore faith into the hearts of their believers. Or perhaps people with faith will find their savior everywhere. From clouds to rock formations, join us as we explore 20 times Jesus Christ was caught on camera. Number 20, Jesus seen in Bulgarian church. In 1993, the residents of Sofia were attending the church ceremony as they usually would. All of a sudden, a woman in the audience started to scream that she could see the tie of the man standing next to her. Nothing too out of the ordinary, right? Well, here's the thing. The woman was blind since her birth. Everyone in the audience was shocked and mesmerized. After all, they had allegedly witnessed a miracle that they had only heard from the biblical stories. Enchanted and captivated, the church attendees kept singing gospels and continued with their ceremony as the woman thanked God for the miracle. It would be much later when the audience would realize that there was an extraordinary presence in the church who made himself hardly noticeable. You see, that day in the church was special. After the lifting of the Iron Curtain in the aftermath of the fall of the Soviet Union, a group of American evangelical singers went to Bulgaria to minister to the churches. When they came back to Tennessee, they were tasked to put together a tape for the donors who had supported their trip. While compiling the footage and clip, they noticed a man dressed in white with long hair and a beard. They couldn't believe what they were seeing. The man in the video looked like the typical depiction of Jesus Christ. To investigate further, they sent the tape to the church in Sofia, where none of the attendees could identify the mysterious person. In fact, most of the people, who were standing on the same spot where Jesus was seen, didn't see anyone there. It felt like Jesus made his trip to the church, healed the blind woman, and took his leave. The American evangelical singers also sent a note to Sophia saying, we make no claims, but in their reading of the situation, the circumstances were pretty atypical. So their learning of the sighting was pretty simple. They were perhaps seeing Jesus Christ on their screens. Later, the clip went viral according to the virality standards of the mid-90s at least. The clip was distributed to families and churches using VHS tapes. This is why the clip has developed a digital footprint. But the church is not the only place where Jesus Christ made an appearance as you're about to find out. Number 19, a biblical cloud formation in Argentina. Monica Aramayo, a resident of San Salvador de Jejui, Argentina, was out and about doing her typical daily chores. What she didn't know was that she was about to get a blessing from God himself. Monica was out when she just casually looked up at the sky and what she saw moved her to tears. On a single glance, the sky looked clear, beautiful, and blue. But once Monica looked at the cloud formation closely, she could see a face in the heavens. And she immediately knew what she was seeing, a clear-cut imagery of Jesus Christ embedded in the clouds. Shaken, she reached for her phone and took a perfectly timed picture of the skies. Later, she shared the picture on the internet in the hopes of blessing others. Folks online were captivated too. Many could see the similarity between Monica's photo and the statue of Christ the Redeemer in Rio de Janeiro, located less than 3,000 miles away from Argentina in Brazil. But some eagle-eyed people could see something else entirely. People pointed out that the illustrious picture showed their savior wearing a crown and his arms outstretched, which is pretty similar to other mainstream demonstrations of Jesus Christ. What do you think? If you're shocked, this next incident will leave you in awe. Number 18. Jesus appeared in Notre Dame fire. In April 2019, the world helplessly saw one of the oldest Catholic cathedrals getting ravaged by a deadly fire. There was significant damage done to Notre Dame, which is located in Paris, France. While the restoration procedures are ongoing and authorities have conducted an investigation into what might have happened, the world is still theorizing about the fire. Right after the incident, the internet started to give a religious angle to the situation. Since the altar and the cross at Notre Dame didn't incur any damage, many people believed that the fire itself was a divine intervention of some sort. 
And it didn't help when a woman online claimed that she saw Jesus' face in the flames that ravaged Notre Dame. After her post went viral, others could see the silhouette of Jesus in the fire too. While a lot of people were generally skeptical about the imagery, the woman was convinced that her observation would bring comfort and closure to the people who were mourning the loss of their beloved cathedral. And well, that part was, at least, true. A lot of people online took the silhouette as a sign of remaining faithful and committed to the cause of bringing positivity to the world. At the same time, the image generated a lot of controversy too. As the video went viral, people expressed their concern over turning Notre Dame into a site of tourism rather than just worship. They expressed that Jesus' silhouette was more of a warning sign than a source of catharsis. Either way, people were left shocked and mesmerized. Number 17. Image of Christ in Rocks Ever heard of the saying that you'll find faith in the most mysterious places? Well, that's the story of Shea House, a Virginia resident who is fond of running and hiking. It's very common for House to discover new tracks for her morning runs. As a university student, she would choose a spots near her campus. And one day she stumbled up on something miraculous. While walking, she passed by a rock that ignited some sort of excitement in her. The rock was big enough, but Shay couldn't make any sense of what she was seeing. As she walked closer to the rock, she was surprised to see the face of Jesus Christ right in front of her. It seemed like no one had carved the rock. Naturally, it had taken the image of the Messiah. Shay had to upload her findings on YouTube for other people to witness the phenomenon. In the clip, you can hear Shay asking, Do you see the nose, shut eyes, crown of thorns, bruised and puffy, left eye, punched wounded puffy, left cheek, beard, mustache, hair, long hair down the right side? As Shay zoomed her camera into the rock, the image of Jesus Christ became clearer. The miraculous rock is located on the Blackwater Creek Trail, just a few miles off of Liberty University's campus. Shay couldn't believe her luck. While talking to a local news channel about her discovery, she also revealed that she was listening to her praise and worship on her phone while walking. Throughout her trip, she found moments to praise God, and luckily for her, she got acknowledged by Christ. If you're still feeling a little skeptical, just check out the next astounding moment Jesus was caught on camera in Italy. Number 16. Jesus Appears in Italy Alfredo Lobruto, a resident of Agropoli in Italy, hardly ever used social media. But after witnessing something miraculous and extraordinary, he had the urge to share his discovery with the world. Alfredo was out in his hometown during sunset when he noticed something unusual about how the sun's rays were illuminating. Upon closer inspection, he could see that the sunlight had split into a pattern, or rather an image, that he was quite familiar with. The cloud formation around the sinking sun was a spitting image of Jesus Christ. Alfredo was both fascinated and awe-inspired. The likeness of the cloud formation to the Son of God looked very enchanting, and Alfredo had to share the picture with his fellow believers. Talking about the experience, he said, I was enchanted by the view. I instantly felt like I wanted other people to see it because it was so beautiful. He could instantly see that the image resembled the famous Christ the Redeemer statue from Brazil. Only this time, the Messiah was looking over the still waters of the Tyrrhenian Sea. This was straight up amazing, but you know what else is amazing? Jesus Christ being spotted in Asia. Number 15. Jesus in the Philippines YouTube vlogger, whose screen name is Me Bubs, was out with her camera when she saw a weird arching of the skies. By the looks of it, she was taking a stroll in her hometown in the Philippines when the sun peeked through a strange figure in the skies. The weather was cloudy, so Me Bubs didn't seem to pay any attention to it, but after zooming into the clouds a bit, she couldn't believe her eyes. The skies were embellished with a picture of Jesus Christ, which left the vlogger shocked and dumbfounded. See it for yourself. Number 14. Jesus Saves the Airplane Believe it or not, there's a lasting picture of Jesus Christ looking over the skies and saving hundreds of lives. Cited as the ultimate proof that God exists, a woman was able to take a picture of the skies 
while her airplane faced extreme turbulence. Her flight was terrifying because of the horrible weather conditions. The pilot had to fly through a turbulent storm that shook the aircraft to its core. Panicked passengers began to believe that they wouldn't reach their destination at all. The woman who took the picture remembers the entire scene being very chaotic and anxiety-inducing. But in that moment of extreme fear, she looked behind her and found an old woman on a window seat just silently praying. She was so moved that despite harrowing turbulence, she walked up to the old woman and inquired if she was Christian. The praying woman nodded in approval and both of them began to pray together. According to the woman herself, she had prayed for God to end the storm as he had 2,000 years ago according to a biblical account. The two devoted ladies prayed loud enough for other passengers to join them, and within seconds, the turbulence subsided, and while the storm carried on, it was a lot calmer. That's when the young woman decided to take a picture of lightning that was flashing across the sky. Much later, she took her camera to the photo developer to get hard copies of her pictures. And you won't believe what happened next. The photo developer asked the woman if she could also see a man floating in the skies. And well, she was taken aback. Among the skies and in the flash of lightning was a man wearing a robe resembling the Son of God. There's no official source for the story, but it is largely believed that the photo developer converted to Christianity after witnessing the miracle for himself. The woman took the photo home, and her family and friends were left shocked, too. Today, the picture serves as a family heirloom. People who are suffering from a crisis of faith often take a look at the picture to restore their belief in God. Just like these people who were at the mercy of a life-threatening pandemic. Number 13. The Colombian Miracle In April 2020, Colombia was grappling with hundreds of coronavirus cases, just like the rest of the world. While the country was in lockdown, as per the government's mandate, something prompted the residents of the town of Magangay in northern Colombia to break the rules and step outside of their quarantine. The word on the street was that a miracle had revealed itself on a tree's branches. Out of nowhere, the branches had transformed into an image of Jesus Christ on a cross. At first, the news was dismissed as a rumor until images of the tree branches began to surface online. And in the miserable times of COVID-19, everyone wanted to be blessed. Overnight, Hundreds of people marched towards the tree to pray for the people who had died of the virus and for the overall well-being of the world. But the police soon had to intervene. The mass mobilization of people had created a ruckus in the neighborhood as the tree was turned into a pilgrimage point with candles. Not to mention, hundreds of people were praying together without practicing social distancing. They weren't even wearing masks. While the people soon retreated, the tree stood there in its glory. Anyone who took a careful look at the branches knew what they were seeing. There was no denying, people could see a clear-cut image of their savior. Many locals were disappointed that the police had forced them to return as they were already angry at quarantining measures like the lockdown. However, the images of Jesus Christ in a tree were still circulated on the internet, prompting people to say their prayers online. Till now, we've talked about seeing Jesus However, would you believe some believers even heard the words of Jesus? Number 12. The Real Voice of Jesus There's no way for us to restore the voice of Jesus Christ, but that doesn't mean that the Son of God doesn't speak to his believers. He just has extraordinary methods of making himself heard. On September 11, 1999, hundreds of Marians from several parts of the world converged in Battery Park, New York for a religious event called the World Marian Peace Regatta. As part of the festival, Marians carried out several religious activities, including a mass in their local church. The event was going rather usual until something extraordinary happened during consecration. The priest who was in charge of the ceremony suddenly had a deep, moving change in his voice, leaving everyone confused and fascinated. It was Father Gerard who raised the holy post during the consecration, and as soon as he raised the post, his voice began to tremble. Then the words that came out of his mouth weren't his, but that of Jesus Christ. At least that's what the audience believed. After all, they had felt the change and tremble in Father Gerard's voice twice. 
once when he raised the host and second when he raised the cup. In the voice of Jesus, the Father had said the most awe-inspiring part of the prayer, for my body would be given up for you. No wonder people in the audience were left deeply motivated and surprised. Many of them believed that Jesus had taken the spirit of Father Girard to deliver the message of faith and reverence. As you'll discover next, a lady in Colombia did not see Jesus, but she did see someone else uh, that left her in Udershock. Number 11, Apparition of the Virgin Mary. In 1997, a Colombian woman was praying at her local church when she witnessed something that left her blessed and surprised at the same time. She immediately reported her sightings to her fellow believers and the priests. What happened next was a mass mobilization of people who had hoped to see the miracle for themselves. On the very same day, the woman was praying in the church of the sanctuary of the Sopo Stone in the Colombian town of Sopo, some 50 kilometers northeast of the capital, Bogota. She claimed that she saw the apparition of the Virgin Mary while she was offering her prayers to the replica of the stone of Our Lord of the Stone of Sopo, a revered icon that is as old as 1753. And in the blink of an eye, the Virgin Mary's silhouette appeared next to the left side of the stone too. Regular attendees of the church reported that they had never seen the silhouette before until the woman witnessed the miracle. The news of the apparition spread like wildfire. People traveled long distances to witness the apparition of Our Lady of Carmel. While the church itself was a bit hesitant to approve the miracle, it really didn't matter. Hundreds of women and children flocked into the church to ask the Virgin Mary for special favors and to bring ease in their lives. The woman who witnessed the apparition was glad that she was able to give her fellow devotees a sense of comfort during hard times. Now, from the next clip, it looks like people also felt Jesus' presence in some very unlikely places. Number 10. Jesus Seen in Ohio In the year 1986, a common agricultural processing plant in the west of Fostoria, Ohio, became holy and sacred overnight. After all, the locals were caught in a frenzy. They had seen an image of Jesus Christ around the plant. Back in 1986, there was no way for the image to go viral on the internet. But the word of Christ had spread like wildfire, causing people to travel long distances to see the miracle for themselves. News archives about the incident show that the Ohio Route 12 between Findlay and Fosteria was jammed for miles by the onlookers wanting to get blessed by Christ. Witnesses of the image were left awestruck by what they were seeing. But of course, several were skeptical too. Even if they could see someone remotely like Jesus, they couldn't see why the Son of God would appear in a newly assembled soybean oil storage tank. Nothing about the alleged visual of Jesus made sense. Hundreds of people sat on the grass that gave them a clear view of the tank. The yellow paint of the storage complex was illuminating under the moonlight, and people could see the silhouette of a robed Jesus and a young child. Stunned? So are we. But coming up is another surreal moment that left onlookers spellbound. Number 9. Jesus Christ in the Skies Pablo Morales, a resident of California, was right outside of his house when he recorded extraordinary footage. During the nighttime, Morales was hanging out with his wife and a friend. The trio was joking around and smoking. Then suddenly, Pablo looked up and glanced at the sky when he noticed something strange floating out there. On a single glimpse, it looked like a giant balloon that was left loose. But as he took a closer look, he could see a human form floating in the skies. And just not any average human, the floating being resembled Jesus Christ. Talking about the experience, Morales said, we were and still are shocked because it looks like a man floating. It glides through the sky and makes a plunge down to earth like it was landing. He quickly took out his phone and recorded the phenomenon. In the footage, we can hear Morales praying and expressing shock and disbelief at what he was seeing, which alerted his wife and the friend. People online hypothesized that perhaps Pablo had seen a balloon or perhaps a drone but the man rejected those theories since he lives near the airport where low-lying objects can't fly. Moving on, it looks like Colombia has witnessed many such miracles. Number 8. Landslide Reveals the Face of Jesus In 2015, Putumayo, 
in Colombia experienced a severe landslide. But instead of avoiding the area for safety concerns, hundreds of Colombians flocked to the town to witness a miracle. The face of Jesus appeared on a hill after the landslide. Locals, who were excited to see Christ, alleged that true devotees and faithful people could see the miracle if they made a close inspection. The internet was largely unconvinced, but of course, that hardly mattered. The crowd around the hillside was so massive that the police had to be called in for help. Wonder how these locals would react if they came face to face with Jesus Christ in the Holy Land, coming up next. Number seven, Jesus appears in Israel. Surprisingly, very little early Christian art has endured the folds of time in the Holy Land despite it being the religion's birthplace. However, a project carried out by archeologists in Israel brought them face to face with Jesus Christ. The team was searching for art in Shivta, a large Byzantine farming village in Israel's Negev desert, when they found an early depiction of the Messiah on a wall painting. While the art was considerably eroded, archeologists were still able to see the story of Jesus that was carved on the walls. And behold, they were able to put an image to one of the carvings. The baptistery at Shivta showed Jesus as a man with curly short hair, a long face, and an elongated nose. Nothing about the depiction could align with our imagination of Jesus with long, flowy hair and sometimes a beard. Previously, archaeologists had found art depicting Jesus' transfiguration, birth, and baptism too. Now, let's fly over to Indonesia where its locals experienced a shower of blessings. Number six the Jesus-like cloud in Indonesia. It was a fine routine morning in Indonesia when suddenly a remarkable natural phenomenon left people inspired and blessed. Cloud formation in the skies had taken up a striking resemblance to Jesus Christ. Many people stepped outside of their homes to witness the miraculous event themselves. Naturally, pictures and videos of the mesmerizing clouds made their way to Twitter garnering thousands of views and reactions from the devotees. Many people noticed that the celestial miracle looked even more fascinating as the sun cast its radiant light upon the Jesus-like cloud. Individuals noticed that the backdrop made the picture even more awe-inspiring. It just proves that the Holy Presence can be discovered even in nature, just like this next moment. Number five, Angel in the Skies. A couple in Montgomery, Texas, was on their way to a meeting when they passed by Lake Conroe. As a force of habit, the husband looked at the sky to capture beautiful pictures of the sun that was about to set. That's when he noticed the mesmerizing pattern of the clouds that closely resembled an angel flying. Later, he uploaded the awe-inspiring picture on the internet, which garnered thousands of views and likes as people felt blessed online. A man from Kent also posted a video online and viewers were left speechless. Number four, the hand of God. David Christie, a resident of Kent, stepped outside of the home to grab lunch when he witnessed a hand-like pattern in the clouds embedded in the dark skies. Christie posted the video online and many dubbed the wind funnel as the hand of God, the sheer power that had created the world, according to several biblical accounts. Now wait till you see what this next TV manager experienced. Number three, face of Jesus in a park. Roger Jones, a retired TV rental manager, was meditating and praying in Merthyr Tidefield's Seifarthfa Park when he witnessed something extraordinary in the skies. After completing his prayers, he looked up to the sky and the clouds quite suddenly took the face of Jesus Christ. Jones is well aware that sometimes people see images or patterns in clouds and rocks that are simply not there. While the practice is common in religious people, Jones believes that what he saw wasn't a mistake or an accident. At the end of his prayers, he had asked God for a sign, and it felt like the divine power had followed through with the request. Number two, Jesus appeared in Argentina. General Las Hera, a small town in Buenos Aires, Argentina hardly ever made news until one day out of nowhere, its rarely used city center went viral on social media. A man who was taking a walk nearby noticed something strange on the trunk of a tree that was cut off. The odd pattern encouraged him to walk closer to the trunk and what he saw left him dumbfounded. 
The pattern was neither odd nor confusing. It was a clear image of Jesus Christ that had developed naturally on the wooden shroud. The man immediately alerted his fellow devotees and townsmen. In a mere second, the city center erupted into pilgrims who wanted to see the miracle for themselves and pray to Jesus Christ. And finally, it is even in poignant moments of tragedy that one can find comfort and blessings. Number 1. The 9-11 Miracle A man in Hoboken, New Jersey, was taking pictures of the moving 9-11 memorial across the Hudson River when he noticed something unusual in the skies. As part of the tribute to the lives lost during the attack, the organizers emitted two powerful ghostly lights in the sky, and at the end of the beam, the man could see the figure of Jesus Christ. It felt like the Son of God himself was floating above the river to bless the lives lost on 9-11. The floating image of Jesus Christ soon became an internet sensation. In particular, families and loved ones of the victims felt a lot of catharsis when the image of Jesus floating in the clouds went viral. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.